Keepers, just another small demonstration of our new SmartSun LED PWM controller working on our nano system with our exclusive LED lighting as you can see which fits perfectly over the nano system. Um, I will just quickly take you through the functions of what the PWM controller actually does. It adds intelligence to the lighting where you can actually set up your various um, strengths of your various channels so for example if we want to I'm just quitting out of this we want to go to edit we want to edit a profile you are given a few profiles that are pre-coded okay for example the override profile which is a profile that you want to override the unit and your channels both your white and your blues will be set to 100% then we've got the default profile which is our profile which we've basically hard coded into the unit for the lazy guys that don't want to set up the unit themselves thereafter you have 25 profiles that you can basically test for yourself one of it you can store which can be for example acclimate mode so when you're introducing new corals you will basically use the acclimate profile that you've set up and then slowly tell your LED lighting to increase in capacity while your corals are acclimating. So for example, we want to enter, we want to go into editing this profile. We will, this profile now becomes active once it says setting save. It gives you an option to edit the brightness, yes or no. For example, I'm editing the brightness now. So for every single hour, I have got a brightness intensity which, I will, which I'm able to set for each white and blue channel. Okay, so you've got that. The next one would just be blue. I will escape out of this. Okay, um, what I'll do now quickly is I'll just show you a demo of Profile 3 running on the tank, stepping through the hours. Very simply done by pressing the menu button, choosing the demo function. We will bypass the storm function for now, but we will, go, we will do the profile demo. Okay, here it goes. So that will now take a demo version of the tank. We're now stepping through the hours, in the early hours of the morning, 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock, 6 a.m. There the lighting start, starts to come on slowly. I'll just switch the lights off. And you see the tanks lighting gradually starting to increase until we see 100% capacity at noon. Going towards dusk, the lights will then dim out slowly, slowly, slowly until it totally fades away at night. Okay, having said that, while you guys are while you guys are watching, I will basically show you a demo of our storm function. The storm function. The storm function is very, very nice in that it what it actually does is it's got a. I'm just going to go into edit my storm. Okay, the the fantastic thing is we've got storm intensities. We've got how often you want a storm to run, and we've got when you want the storm to run. So if I go into edit my storm along, I need to set the the year naturally, um, and I set the month and the day. Okay, I'll set the hour I need the storm to run and the storm duration. So we choose one minute, two minutes, three minutes, five minutes, whatever we please, um, and we go next. That will that that gives us this time and save. And here's a nice feature. Here we've got the, the storm intensity that we would like to set, which is number one is very rapid. In other words, lots of flashing, a big storm on your reef. This goes right to a scale up to 10 being rapid, normal, weak, weak, and very weak storm. So for now, I'm going to set a very rapid storm, okay? Um, and my storm duration being two minutes. And here the storm is the storm frequencies. When do you want to activate the storm? You've got an option to say, every day I want my storm to run at a specific time, or you can say every three days I'd like my storm to kick in. So that's just a little extra features that we built into the unit for you. I'll escape out of this and then I will basically edit. You've also got an option to edit the demo of any of any uh, option on the unit, feature on the unit. So if we go into, I'm going to choose to edit the demo version. So I'm editing the demo version. I'm leaving it on rapid. Okay, and I'm going to leave my storm running for two minutes. Okay, so to show you how the demo is actually working, 
um, have a focus on the tank and I will start it off. There we go, demo mode, and we go storm demo. There we go. So that is the storm function running now with total random flashes triggered by cosmic noise received on one of the chips. And it just adds a very, very nice feature to the LED lighting. So this is currently set to a very rapid storm. Um, and uh, you can see that we, 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 we've got quite a lot of flashes flashing all over the show. Um, as I say, total randomness between the whites and the blues. Sometimes the blues are on with the whites, they flash at the same time, but it's just completely random. So there we go. So it's quite a nice feature. Gives some intelligence to our lighting. It's not just an on and off system. And you've got the option to set the different intensities of your blues and your whites whenever you wish and however you please to change the look of your reef system. Thank you for listening. Cheers.